pull it down, the flesh will move. So beside that, if you grab the spine and pass your nails, you will feel threads or channels inside. Do you want to try it? In the base, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. I'm going to stop here just because if you do this, the spines get stiff. If you go this, the spines will keep going. So, close to the base. Now, the ventral ones, or the belly ones, this one also poisonous. Venomous, I'm sorry. The other side as well. The anal one, the butt one. Let's go further. What is that? I don't know. We'll figure out in a minute. Huh. Interesting. Some kind of gel stuff. So, we got the side ones. Then we go by the butt ones. It's this one that is really, really uh, venomous. Okay. So, you go in the back. But James, are you watching? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, I leave normally the one in the back just for. Uh, for the show, yeah, we um, just for aesthetic. Fish the, looks nice these are are like these this. venomous too? No. Oh, okay. But the people what do they cut it, let it dry, and then put epoxy on it, and they can do jewelry out of it. Oh, okay. So to clean it, I will cut under the close to the heels, and I will go back. So basically, we're gonna open the belly, and this is a lady. So two mulberries. Yeah. You see the dots? Oh yeah, all those are it. So what I do, I normally take this that is not really neat. It's just flesh that covers the, the sack, to say somehow. Put this away. Put this away. Uh, now you hunt it, you have to eat it raw. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like drinking the blood of a deer. Uh, exactly. So, another fold of eggs, you throw it away, some fish will eat it. And you want the head, or I should take it out of the right way? I think I'm going to get to the